conversation with Troy Alexander one more time right here on Hamilton Radio. I'm telling you right now, we are excited about what God is. Lord, I'm, 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 listen, I'm getting this show mixed up from an hour of faith. Ruben, I'm telling you, Will, I'm telling you. It's, 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 but listen, it's racing with Troy Alexander. <laughs> listen, I do two shows on Hamilton Radio, so I do one an hour of faith from 7 to 7.30, and then I do my dream vision and purpose one from 8 to 9. But listen, we are getting ready tonight. I'm, I'm so excited about what has transpired from last week to this week. This show is about dream, take that step, and walk with purpose into your destiny. I'm telling you right now, I'm, I'm excited about what is taking place in your life, <laughs> in your life, and, and in my life. Because right now, it's not about where I am now. It's about where I'm going. It's about where you're going. And I'm telling you right now, there is so much in store for you. I, I was talking to the producer, Will, and listen, there, there, there is so much. All we got to do is put ourselves in the path to which we are going to connect with our destiny and our purpose. We got to walk into places. Listen, it's not about um, waiting for the invite, but it's, it's making the request known to them. Listen, this is what I want to do. This is where I need to do it. And how can we make it happen? It's, it's about making a declaration in your life that where you are is not the end. Knowing there is something more destined for your life. And, and not just, you know what, this is where I'm at. This is where I'm going to stay. This is how it's going to be. If that is your mindset, that's all you're going to have. But right now, it is about having a mindset to say, I got a dream and I want something more than a dream. I'm going to wake up out of this dream. I'm going to set a plan and have a plan in place and begin to set my goals and set my objectives and set my timelines, get my resources, whatever in it, and begin to move in the direction of your destiny. I'm telling you right now, this is what it's all about. And this show is here to help you, to support you, to, 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 to get there together with you, to say you don't have to do this by yourself. So don't try to figure it out. Listen, we're getting ready. We're starting a Dreamers Club. And, and, and officially, probably no later than the beginning of August, even sooner. The Dreamers Club is talking about people who have dreams and putting dreamers together. And, and, and what our nonprofit, Call to Inspire Incorporated, what it's going to do, it is going to bring dreamers together, people who who, who have visions beyond where they are right now and, and, and begin to support each other and, and be there for each other. I have a directory. Before I even go there, our Dreamers Club has already begun. I began to, uh, there was a young person that, that wanted to go into the modeling industry, had a contact number. Had, so I made the phone call today, spoke to the owner of the modeling agency, got all the details for the young lady and her mother, and, and I said, I'm going to make the connection. I'm going to bridge the gap. So because sometimes what happens is all somebody needed for somebody to encourage them and uplift them and to hold their hands up and say, you can do this. I am your biggest cheerleader. I will be your biggest support. Listen, you can do it, but you got to believe. You got to believe in yourself, believe in your gift, believe in your talent, believe in your ability, and begin to develop the craft and develop it and grow even more. So I'm telling you right now, there is something greater. So this Dreamers Club, I'm so excited, Reuben and Will, this Dreamers Club is going to grow. It's going to expand. Why? Because everybody needs somebody to believe in them. I'm telling you, listen, all of us needed to have somebody say, you can do that, Troy. Hold on. Take your time. Uh, we'll wait for you. We'll, we'll, what do you need? You know, and, and it's so valuable to have somebody in your corner that, that, that believe, not only just believe in you, but that's going to help you get there or give you the resources or give you some knowledge or tell you, go that way. And it feels good when you know you got somebody in your corner. I'm telling you, this show, Inspiration with Troy Alexander, is in your corner. Whatever you want to, listen, if you got to go to the, to the subway and, and, and sing your song for somebody to hear you, do that. Get you a YouTube page, do that. Get you whatever you got to do to make your gift and make your talent and make your ability known. That is what you got to do. Say, I'm going to do this 
no matter what the cost, and again, I, I, I'm not talking about now, you know, but I'm talking about costs you can afford now. But it is something that you have to say in your mind that I'm willing to make this sacrifice to, to, to get to the place that I want to get to. I'm telling you. So not only that, we started a Dreamer Supporting Dreamers directory. It's on my wall. I had a, a, a vision one day of, of having a director as a phone book where you can go and find resources, uh, uh, singers and, and musicians and, and, and people doing video, people making uh, cakes, what, what, whatever it is, and it's growing. So if you want to be added to our directory, Dreamers Supporting Dreamers directory, email me at IamInspiredTroy at gmail.com or call to inspire at AOL.com. Send me an email. Give me the details of who you are and what you do, your, your business, your entrepreneurship, whatever you're trying to do. You know, and I got to make sure that everything is on the up and up, make sure that it's, it's legit. Every, you know, but once we do all of that, we'll add you to our directory. It goes out once, two, three times a week to, to promote other people doing great things. And I'm telling you right now, this is what we're all about, supporting other people, especially young people. Letting them know, don't you ever give up your dream, no matter what age you are, no matter what experience you have, no matter where you come from. There are people out there that say, you know what, when you come from the other side of the tracks, uh, you won't be nothing. Well you, well, you know what, show them wrong. Prove them wrong. Let them know that, listen, it don't matter what town I come from. It don't matter what the name of my city is. It's, it's, it's about having a belief and a determination that I'm going to make a change in my life. It's going to cost you something, though. It's going to cost you sometimes some time. might cost you some friends. might cost you some family. But you got to make, make up in your mind that this is what I want something greater than where I am right now. And I got so much that I got to share with you. It's been an amazing week. Listen, I did a photo shoot uh, this week with, 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 with two twins, Reuben and Will. It was, they 12 years old. And Sarah and Kimmy, follow them on Instagram. I'm telling Sarah and Kimmy, follow Yeah, that's it. That's, that's Sarah and Kimmy, 12 years old, models, dancers, amazing. Did, did a wonderful photo shoot with them, connected with them on Instagram, and, and, and we went to this amazing destination, did a photo shoot, and we're doing another. And guess what? I'm looking to have them come on my show. I'm expecting, before this month is over, I believe they're going to show. We're just trying to find a date. Hopefully, we, hopefully. It all can work out, but I'm telling you right now, it's about connecting yourself with people. Listen, they, they are dancers. They, they go out to California, dancing shows, videos. This, listen, you don't know who knows who. I don't know who Ruben knows or Will knows. They don't know who I know, but all of us together, we know a whole lot of people. I'm telling you, this is what it's all about. It's about making a connection, and when you make the connection, Listen, it's time to move. I'm, I'm getting ready. I said it before, and I'll say it again. There's an audience. There's space for an audience. You could come here on Monday night and watch the show live. Talk to myself before the show. Talk to the producer. Learn how to be an intern here at Hamilton Radio. There's so many opportunities that are, are, are here, but it's about taking advantage of what you see and what is before you and not, and, and not saying, I can't do that. Uh, I can't get there. Uber, uh, 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 say, Troy, listen, let me know, let some, this is what you want to do. When you make your, your, your vision, when you make it known to others, now, now be careful, but when you make it known to the right people, they'll support you getting to where you need to go. You don't know, some, listen, we had some, 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 title, some pageant title holders that were on my show, uh, Ruben and Will, a couple of weeks ago, had about eight of them on the show, a wonderful show. Somebody saw the show. I started talking about my radio anniversary on October 5th from 10 o'clock to about 12.30, 1 o'clock at the E-Hotel Banquet and Conference Center in Edison, New Jersey, 1173 King George's Post Road. So we were talking about that event. I want everybody to come out if you can. It's $30, but you get a buffet breakfast, a fashion show, and you get to network with some amazing people for $30. Now, now how much? We spend $30 sometimes going to get fast food. But I'm telling you, how much would it be to spend $30 to come to an event 
and meet some amazing and wonderful and network because you never know where it might take you. So anyway, I, after that, doing that show, somebody saw that show and said, Troy, I want to sponsor those who were on this show to go to your radio anniversary celebration at the E-Hotel October 5th. Paid in full. All I'm telling you is you have to make yourself visible. I've said it time and time again. I've said it before, if I can't see you, I can't hear you, can't find you. Make your gift visible. So we had a wonderful, so shout out to Kimmy and Sarah. So proud of you. And I'm looking forward to having you on our show. We're going to give you a shout out, but definitely follow them, uh, uh, Sarah and Kimmy. Uh, follow them on, on Instagram, the amazing twins, 12 years old. I'm telling you. Phenomenal young lady, so I'm proud of them. I'm proud of them. Listen, something happened to me this week, y'all. Reuben and Will, something, something powerful. I, had, I, I told y'all before that I was recognized as Dreamer of the Month. Dreamer of the Month uh, by this company on Instagram called Dreamality Studio. Dreamality Studio. Makeup and Design. I was recognized as Dreamer of the Month for the month of June. I was so honored and humbled. But I submitted an application. I told my story. I told my story as a young man who stuttered in school, in elementary school, uh, on, on for many years after, and how I was afraid to go to school. And whenever we had to give a book report, I would think like I was sick. And, and so I didn't have to go in front of the class and, and read that book report. And so many, and, and this had so much uh, fear in my life. And so I told my journey, I told my story uh, uh, on Instagram. I did the application to inspire somebody, to uplift them, to let them know, look at me now. Who would ever think that that young man who did not have a dream in his life, couldn't even couldn't conjure up a dream, but now will have his own radio show with his name on the show. I'm telling you, who would ever dream that? But they do come true. So, so this Dreamality Studio, makeup and design on Instagram. So I did the application. They recognized me as Dreamer of the Month for the month of uh, 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 June. And um, they sent me these wonderful gifts. So I'm going to show you. But one day I'm going to wear the shirt on the show. But, but they sent me a personalized shirt that says, Marcellus, I believe in you. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you right now, I can't make this up. And, and, and on the back, it says, believe. The power of believing. So I want to thank Miss um, Tiffany Hyatt, again, with the Dreamality Studio Makeup and Design. Follow them, dreamalitystudio.com. And, and along with that, they gave me this, this notepad that says, I believe you can you have the power. You got this. No fear. Be encouraged. Have faith. It's a powerful, wonderful uh, notebook, notepad. On the back of it, it says, here's a little something to help you keep track of your dreams. And then she wrote me a note, a personalized note, uh, and, and, and said they were going to make a donation to our nonprofit. I, I'm telling you, I got it today, y'all. I got the donation today. And, and I'm so honored that, that, um, that she believed, that her team believed in me enough to make me dreamer of the month for the month of June. I'm here to let you know, don't you stop dreaming. Even if you might not be able to do it right now, but tell yourself, I'm going to do it one day. I believe that I'm going to have a television show. I guess I'm, I, I guess I'm on the way with Hamilton, but right here on Hamilton Radio, Hamilton Radio News. Whatever, Hamilton Radio, television station. I'm telling you, we're getting ready, y'all. Something great is about to take place right here on Hamilton Radio. And I'm excited about what is to take place and what's coming. But, but don't ever give up on your dreams. You might be 50 years old. Don't, don't give up on your dreams. You might be five years old. Don't give up on your dreams. Because there are some young people that I know right now that don't even believe that, that, that what they're trying to get to, they can actually have. But I'm telling you right now, I need you to know that you can get to the place where it is that you're trying to get to. Because I'm a witness, you can do it. You can do this. 
Listen, I got a point of purpose that I got to share with you real quick. Um, and I talked about vision a lot. I talk about vision a lot. And, 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 and allow your vision to go further than, than what you see. You got to let your, you got to see beyond the now. I'm going to say that again. You got to see beyond the now. Thank you all again for those who are on Facebook. I see you. Thank you, uh, uh, Christine. Thank you, Elizabeth. Thank you, Shamise, Helen, Taisha, Ma Carl. All, thank for everybody who's watching live. Uh, do, appreciate you. But I'm telling you right now, you got to allow your dream, your, your vision to go further than what you see. You can't stop at the now. I need you. you listen, whatever you got to get to, whatever's going to help you get to the place, to let you know, listen, uh, listen, that fighter, that boxer, sometimes they might put a headset on and listen to some music, get ready for the fight. Listen, you got to do what, read, a, read something that inspires you. Whatever is going to get you to the place where you fight for your dreams, y'all. <laughs> fight for your dreams. It's time to fight for the dream that you believe in and not allowing every circumstance, every excuse, Every, because anybody can say that um, I don't have the, I don't, all of us didn't have it at some point. Somebody, but I'm telling you, when you, when you start walking in your destiny and in your purpose and in your dreams, there is something, people begin to be drawn to you. And, 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 and I, I told you about our Dreamers Club. I made the phone call today for a 15 year old young lady and, and her mom got all the information. Got all the contact, set it up, sent them the information, said, thank you so much. And so this Dreamers Club is going to connect with everybody at least once a week. Might be an email, might be a text, might be a phone call. But we're going to stay connected with each other about what steps we are taking that's going to bring us closer to our destiny. I'm telling you right now. I'm working on it right now. How do I... Reuben and Will, how do I get there to be an audience live right here? On, listen, it's going to be standing room only. I've already declared it. Open your mouth. There's a, section on, a segment on this show called I Am Declaration. And the declaration is about opening your mouth and believing something that you don't even see yet, but knowing that it's going to take place. I believe that this, there's going to be an audience in here, Will and, 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 and uh, Reuben. It's going to be an audience in here. It's going to be, listen. It's going to be hard to get a ticket. It is. Why? Because this is going to grow so much it's because it's about connecting dreamers, about somebody believing in you, believing in you. I'm, I'm believing there to be 5,000, 10,000, 100,000 views. Why not? Why not? Because if it, why not you? If somebody, why can't it be you? Why can't that PhD be? Why can't that doctor be you? Why can't that lawyer be you? Why can't that fire person be? Why can't you have that business? I'm telling you, why not? It's not too late. It's, it's, it's all about finding out what you got to do, set your course, and, 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 and making sure that, that, that you align yourself with in the direction that you want to go and not getting distracted. I'm going to say that again. Don't you get distracted by, by, by people who don't believe. Don't you get distracted by, by, by places that, that, that don't have dreams. Sometimes you got to, to change your space, change your environment, change the people you hang around. I said, imagine if the way I talk now, imagine if, if, if that young person that you know, or you might be that person, imagine if we connected Every day, or at least once or twice a week, or imagine how I would not allow you to give up on your dream, mm -mm. because you got to know that it can happen. But you got to believe, like this shirt that they gave me for being a a, a dreamer of the month. It said, "Believe." You got to believe. You got to believe. In spite of everything that is going on now. You have to believe this and know that something greater is coming out of your life. And let me just say this. Don't think that everything you do is going to work out every single time the way that you think it is. It don't. Life doesn't work that way. I had a show, an hour of faith uh, at 7 o'clock. 
<laughs> and I was trying to, you know, because when you do dub live, you sing it live. You know, you want to make sure you've been on, on the right key. You don't want to go off, want to say too high, don't want to sound too bad. But I'm telling you, I took the step. And despite what anybody says, I took the step. There are some people who won't even, who can sing, who won't even grab the microphone. They'll, they'll sing, but, but they won't take that step. But I'm willing, and I need you to be willing to take a step with me toward your dreams, toward your vision. I see, thank you, Jacqueline. Thank you, Gabriel. Gabriel, it's so good to see you. Listen, I'm telling you right now, it is, it is important to, to, to hold on to your dreams. And never give up on your dreams. Take that step. This is what this show is all about. This, this, this show is about dream. Take that step and walk with purpose into your destiny. There is more. Listen, I got another points of purpose. Follow me on Facebook. Points of purpose with Troy Alexander. Hashtag points of purpose with Troy Alexander. But I got another point that I got to share with you real quick. Even the best mountain climber takes one step at a time. You can do this. Listen, even the most skilled mountain climber that has climbed Mount Everest, that has climbed Mount K Kilimanjaro, I think that's how you say it, they have to do it, what, one step at a time. Don't look at somebody and say, wow, they got there so fast. They had to take one step at a time. Everybody does. So all I'm trying to do is to get you, listen, some people haven't even started yet. They still holding on to the dream. They still wishing and believing that they could be in that place or, or, or have their own show or, or go to college or, or start that business. It's time to take it from a dream and take that step, y'all. It is. You've been there too long. You've been having the dreams for too long. And I'm telling you right now, it is time to, to take your dream and get you a plan. And if you don't know how, ask somebody. Listen, everybody that I say, who, whoever tells me they want to do something, talk to somebody that's already doing it. That's a powerful thing right there. So if you want to be a dog catcher, talk to a dog catcher. It's all right. If, if you want to be a whatever it is, talk. And if you don't know, go to Google uh, dog catchers in your town. Matter of fact, you just might be living next door to one, and don't even know it. <laughs> Listen, you don't know who is around you until you start looking. I'm going to say that again. Sometimes you don't know who is around you until you start looking. It is about being intentional about who it is and what it is you want to become in life. I, I, I knew that I wanted to, to, to work with young people and work with families, but I was in my second year of college and had not yet declared a major, going into my third year. And, and, and I'm telling you, it was in that moment, I'm, I'm reading the classifieds. Yes, I'm going to tell you the story. I'm in the back room of, of my grandmother's house. Thank God for my grandmother, Nana. Uh, Scott, love her. Thank you for, for her support in, in that moment, part of our life. And I, I thank all my family, but... I'm, I'm sitting in the back room reading the classifieds, and, and I'm looking at these jobs, and I'm saying, what is it, Lord, what is it that I want to do? Now, mind you, I'm, I'm, I'm going through, I'm at Rutgers, y'all. I'm not at, you know, I, I'm not at, I'm at Rutgers, Rutgers College, and, and, and I'm going through two years of school, still undeclared, but I was in the place where I needed to be. So, so. You know, I was blessed to have taken the classes for the most part that I needed once I declared the major, and it was social work. And, and, and so, but I saw a classified talking about families and young people and, and developing programs. I said, I'm already doing that in my church. I'm already doing that. As, and, and, and so it hit me. But the point is, I kept looking. I, I, I was looking for something. Look for something. It's out there. What, what, whatever you need, it's out there. But you got to be intentional about looking for it. I need you to look for, for whatever it, listen, look, whatever, look for it. 
Write it down and begin to look for whatever it is you are. But you got to know what you're looking for. Will and Ruben, listen, where, where do you want to be? Listen, you, you, you know, uh, uh, Will's a comic. Where do you want to be? I'm not talking about where you are now. Where do you see yourself? That's what I need you to, to know. Listen, you may not see every place, but see another place than where you are right now. You have to see yourself someplace other than where you are. Because that will help you to give you the motivation and give you, have you ever, listen, <laughs> do you remember when you were learning how to ride a bike or, or, or in the pool and, and so you might have had one person on one end, but then there was somebody else talking about, come on, you can do this, come on. Because you, you wanted to get to the other side because you saw the person over there saying, come on, you can do this. Oh, and, 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 and so, so out this show, Inspiration with Troy Alexander is about being the one on the other side. Say, saying, come on, you can do this. You got this. Take whatever you got. If you got to take you a, 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 a one board, if you're a painter, if all you got is one canvas, work on the one canvas. If it get full, turn it over. Work on the other side. And, and, but whatever you got to do, keep on moving towards your destiny and towards your purpose. This is what this show is all about. I didn't, this didn't happen overnight, but I'm telling you, this is, as a matter of fact, uh, Reuben and Will, this is show number 56. We've been on Hamilton Radio every Monday night from, from, from last May to this May. We're getting ready to have our anniversary at the E-Hotel Banquet and Conference Center uh, on October 5th. We'd love to see you there. Having an amazing fashion show, Brand A, with Alyssa Lego and Amanda Wiskowski and, and the wonderful uh, 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 team that's coming with them and the models, amazing young people. These are teenagers that have their own fashion line, their own company. They, they sell these clothes to support uh, young people and, or, or all those who are on the autism spectrum. I, I'm, I'm telling you, you can't make this up. These are young people who are doing amazing things. Amanda is a, is a gold. She, she wins gold in figure skating. She, she's an amazing talent. Alyssa, I mean, nonprofit. She's, a, she's a, I mean, amazing. It, these young people are doing amazing things. But it's about a connection. Oh, and my wife. Her collection is going, is, is going to be on the fashion show on October 5th. I'm telling you, opportunity. The word I'm hearing right now is opportunity. It's about I, I want to create opportunities for others who want more than what they have because they know there is more. I need you to go to calltoinspire.org. If you want to buy a ticket, listen, I'm going to have tickets in, in, in about a week or two where you can buy directly from me for the October 5th, but you can go on to calltoinspire.org and, and there's a link right there or you can message me and, and, and PayPal me or, or you can send me cash app. Listen, there's a way to connect with me. But if you're available, make yourself, put yourself in the room. You don't know who's going to be in that room. The person that you need to connect with and to make your dream a reality might be in that room. I got to give a shout out to my man, Gio, Delavici, Gio, listen, he was our first guest on Hamilton Radio back in May of, of, of 2018. And guess what? He, he was just in the film, John Wick, that was in theaters all around the country, all, as a matter of fact, all around the world. But he was right at the old place, but, but he was on my show, Hamilton Radio. Yes, John Wick, he was in the movie. Picture, right, right, right there with, with all the other... Yeah, I, I, I'm telling you, it's about making connections with people that are going in the, in the direction that you're going, and that's up. I'm telling you right now. Listen, I got another point of purpose I got to share with you. The GPS will get you there, but you have to know what to do after you get there. 
you got to have a purpose plan. You got to have a purpose plan so that when that door opens, that you got a plan to walk through it. I'm, I, I'm telling you, thank, thank God for you, Pastor Shaq, Willie Shaq. Thank, listen, I'm telling you right now that you got to have a purpose plan in life so when that door opens, you can walk on through it. Get yourself ready. P prepare yourself so, so that, that whatever's on the other side, it's yours. Go in claiming it. Go in with an expectation. Listen, it is powerful. When you walk on the court and you believe that you're going to win, it makes a difference. Now, at the end, you know, the score might be a little different, <laughs> but, I, but there's a power in believing. It makes a difference. The power to believe that that, that, that change is going to take place. It is. I believe that this studio is going to be full of guests. It don't cost you nothing. All it costs you is the ability to, to RSVP at IamInspiredTroy at gmail.com, at calltoinspire at aol.com, at m.troyalexander at, 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 at yahoo.com. That's all it takes. Send an email. Say I want to come and be a part of your show and and, and sit in the audience and watch it live and learn how all this works. What a powerful experience. Do you know anybody that wants to be in radio, television, media? What a powerful opportunity. Right here in Robertsville, New Jersey. I'm telling you right now. The power, the power to be able to connect with other people. There's a power. And so all I try to do is I try to connect with other people that are going places and that are doing things because I'm going places and I'm doing things. There's, there's something more. Whatever arena it is, you have to put yourself in the place and be in the position to receive what it is that's destined for your life. When they call your name, be ready. When I came here to Hamilton Radio, I was interviewed by my brother Marco. Thank you, Marco. I so appreciate you, man, for for, for having me on your show. And, and, and from that experience came my own show. But I had to get here. I had to agree to be interviewed. How many of us have turned down opportunity? Uh, uh, I, can't, I can't go this time. I, I got too much on my... Got so that might be the one time that changes the rest of your life. And I'm telling you right now, so when the opportunity opens itself, don't you allow fear, don't you allow doubt, don't you allow what done happened in your past to change the rest of your future. I've told somebody before, don't let one moment change the rest of your life. Everybody go through something. Everybody got an experience. Everybody does. But it's about taking that experience and, 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 and say, you know what, I'm going to learn from it. And, and guess what? I'm going to grow from it. I'm going to embrace. I'm going to look back and say, you know what? Yeah, I didn't like going through, wasn't able to talk, having fear and doubt and uncertainty. Didn't like it. But I can look back and I learn from it and I grow from it. And, 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 and I try to inspire everybody that I can to let them know, listen, Confidence. You got this. And for those who are biblically, it says a just man falls seven times, but what? Get back up again. So I'm encouraging you right now that whatever place that you are, it is not over. I don't know why I'm going this, but, but I need you to know it is not over. This is something that you have to be determined in your life. I got to give a shout out. Listen. If you want me to give you a shout out, if you have an accomplishment or an achievement that you've done, email me at IamInspiredTroy at gmail.com. Let me know what that is. We'd love to give you a shout out right here on the radio show. But I'm going to give a shout out real quick to my friend, Diana Wolf. Shout out to you. I'm, I'm so proud of her. She has. I shared her video on my Facebook page. Her son, I just saw tonight was on the CBS show. There's a CBS show that he was on, on, on um, at 8 o'clock tonight. And I got to go back. 
and I'll get the uh, the 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 name of the show. But I commented on on that, and and she had she had a video of of tips if you wanted to become an actor. Her son, they went out to California, and and it was amazing. But but it's on my page, so I I liked it, and 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 go to Diana Wolf on Facebook. She is right there, and she has a video that explains, gives you tips on being a, on how to get into the acting business. It's there, y'all. It's there, and so I'm telling you right now, it is a powerful uh, um, expression when you can connect with people who are already doing it. What you, it is that you want to do. So I'm telling you right now, it's, it's time, y'all. It is time to move to another level and to another place that, that, that is in your life and declare right now. So I got to give a shout out to Diana Wolf. So proud of you, Diana. Uh, she did a, a wonderful video, again, on, on how to get into the acting business. And um, it's powerful. So watch it. It's on my Facebook page, or you can follow her. Again, at uh, uh, Diana Wolf on Facebook, and I'm telling you right now, I see you, Taisha. Thank you so much again for everybody, but I'm telling you right now, there is, there is a lot more that's out there for your life. So I got to give a shout out to her because you know why I'm so proud of her? Because it was her first time. It was her first time, and she said, I was nervous. She said, I had never done this before, but guess what, y'all? She did it. She did it. She did it. I tell you, I tell you. So, and believe it or not, everybody who starts, they're doing it for the first time. Ruben, when he did his, his, his first show for the first time, all of us had to do something for the first time. So let it be your first time and not your last time. I'm telling you right now. So there is so much. So I want to give you a shout out. I want to give you a shout out. On the show. So if you started that business, if, you, if you've taken that step, if you made an accomplishment or an achievement, let us know because we want to celebrate you. We want to give you a shout out on this show. I'm telling you right now, listen, continue to follow us. We are here every Monday night, nine, 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock Eastern Standard Time right here on Hamilton Radio. Got, I, I see Patricia Vaughn. Thank you so much for watching. I'm telling you, there, there, there is more in store for your life. This is, I'm so grateful for Hamilton Radio. And, and before I go, if you want to call into the show, ask me a question live right now. You can call in at 609-807-2492. 609-807-2492. You can ask me a question right live right here on, on the show or give some feedback or a comment. But I have made it my mission to be a witness to somebody else, to let them know that it's not over. Whatever, wherever you are, there's more. And, and don't allow that moment where you fall down and you're scraping. That's why they make Band-Aids. <laughs> listen, I, 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 I'm telling you, if you scrape your knee, you scrape, wash it off, clean it off, put a Band-Aid, and keep it moving. This is what life it's all about. It's not about just, just, just getting a, a bruise and just say, oh, well, I got a cut, so I'm going to bleed out. Oh, no. Nobody bleeding out on this show. So we're going to put a, a Band-Aid on it and, 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 and look for it to heal, and let's move forward. Don't worry about the scrapes and the bruises. And, and all of us, life is called life. Everybody not going to like you. Everybody not going to support you. But I'm telling you right now, you got to believe in yourself that there's something greater than where you are right now. We have our website, calltoinspire.org. Follow us. We have our nonprofit, Call to Inspire Incorporated. If you want to make a donation to support uh, our mission, which is to uh, support dreamers and, and following their dreams. So we have a mentoring initiative called the Dreamers Club. And, uh, but you can give a PayPal donation to www.paypal.me backslash call to inspire. PayPal.me backslash call to inspire. But I'm telling you right now, I'm getting ready for something else. And, and I'm going to tell you this. I, I've been doing a lot of things 
and I have and, and I have to realign myself into the place where where I've been called to. So just because you can do something doesn't mean that you should do something. So make sure what you're doing is aligned with what you've been destined and what you've been called for. Because that road may not be the road that I'm supposed to take. And so, so make sure that you, that you continue to be watchful and be prayerful, but be watchful and make sure that the road that you are on is the right road that's going to take you to a greater destination. Because you could think that's the right road, and it might not be the right road. So I'm telling you right now, it, it is important to connect yourself with the people who are on the road that you have destined to be on and ask them, how did you get there? It's, it's not rocket science. It's not. It's not. It's about doing your homework, looking up, doing the research, and connecting yourself. And all I'm trying to do is bring somebody with me. I told Hamilton Radio uh, over a year ago, I said, we're going to cry together, we're going to grow together, and guess what? We're going to get there together. I said it over a year, and almost a year and a half, over a year ago, I've declared it to be so. And, 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 and I, listen, I'm going to use every platform, I'm going to use every microphone, I'm going to use every street corner to encourage you and to let you know you can do this. It might be one word that I say for you, that I say to you tonight that changes the trajectory of your life. It might be that one word to say, you can do this. You got this. Yeah, it's okay. I fell down. Yes, I did. Many times. I told y'all before, I had events nobody showed up to. But I learned from it and I grew from it. So all I'm telling you tonight is hold on to your dreams. Don't, don't, don't ever give up on your dreams. It, it just might be one word that I say tonight that encourages you and to let you know that dreams do come true. Yeah, yeah, listen, listen, I'm telling you, Hamilton Radio, this radio show, television, I see, I do a workshop. And the first slide on the workshop is, I'm going to be a billionaire. I've said it, I've declared it for a long time. But it's about a mindset. It's about having a mindset that I'm going to be at a level and I got a vision. I got a goal. Make sure you have a goal because it gives you directions. It gives you direction. Takes your compass of your life. And it it puts you in the right direction having purpose. When you get up, there's nothing like having purpose in your life. I'm telling you right now. And so many people are going through life without knowing what their purpose is. But if you want to invite me, listen, invite me to your youth group, invite me to your church, invite me to your community center, invite me to your, your, your camp. Listen, I'll come to your campground around the bonfire and, and, and do a workshop and, and, and share an inspiring word to let somebody know you can do this. And I'm telling you, I believe in you. This show, Hamilton Radio, believes in you. And we're not talking about just words. This is about a tangible, about believing in, 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 in you and believing in your dreams. And I hope that I've said something tonight to encourage you, to let you know it's not over. It's not over. doesn't matter what time it is. Listen, I, I, I've said it before. Colonel Sanders, KFC didn't, didn't, didn't start going the way it was until the man was in his 60s. KFC didn't, didn't start to the man till, till he was in his 60s. But he kept on trying to get the recipe together. That, 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 that secret recipe over and over again. They tell me, I did a little research on the, on the cleaning uh, substance called 409. And, and, and the reason, one one document said the reason why it's called 409 was because the person who developed it, it took him 409 times to get it right. I'm just saying. So don't worry about how often and how many times that you done tried it. It doesn't, time doesn't just keep moving. Just keep moving. Somebody going to see you. 
somebody gonna, gonna hear you. And knowing where your space is, know where your space is. You might be in a building that seats 50. That might be your calling. And the reason why you're having a, a, a hard time is because you're trying to get the mega church. But, but it might be the one that's got the 50 in it. Why? Because that's where you're needed. But it doesn't stop that you can't grow from that space in terms of the outreach. So I'm telling you right now, there is power in words. That's why I talk the way that I talk. And I don't talk like this just on the show. My wife knows. <laughs> my friends and family know. I talk, I, I talk this on the job, the, the uh, nine to five job with the benefits. Yeah, I, I talk on that job like I'm talking now. I talk in my home as I'm talking now. They'll tell you. I'll bring them on the show. They will call, listen, they'll, call, they'll tell you. The way I talk is the way I talk then. Don't change. So hold on to your confidence. Hold on to, to believing in, in and, and it's, I'm tell, there is power in believing. There is power in believing. It makes a difference. Do you know why one, one was different? Because they believed and one didn't. You got to believe this thing. I believe this down to my bones. I do, y'all. I do. I do. I believe that everybody that's going to come in contact with me, with this station, with our nonprofit, if, if, if they can just believe, it's going to turn everything around. Because when you believe, you walk different. When you believe, you talk different. When you believe, you act different. Yeah, I feel the winds, but I'm rooted in a belief that is unchangeable, unchangeable. And I need you to know that this show, Inspiration with Troy Alexander, believes in you to let you know it's not over. There is something more that I need you to know. Follow us, call to inspire.org. I'm grateful for all those who are watching live right now on Facebook, those who are listening on the Hamilton Radio app, Hamilton Radio 3.0, Channel 2. Thank you so much. Those who are on the phone, thank you so much. I appreciate you, all my family, all my friends, all those who I, I might not even know. But you keep planting seeds. Don't, don't, don't look for, just keep planting seeds. After you don't plant the seed, you know, somebody else might come along and add some water to it. Then you got the sunshine that adds it's power to the growth. But you keep on planting seeds in everybody that you touch. This show is going to plant seeds in everybody who listens to this show. I am not, this is about a, a declaration. I believe. I need, you, I need you to say with me. I believe. I believe. It makes a difference when you believe that something is Something better is coming. I'm telling you right now. Got about 10 minutes left on the show. If you want to call in, 609-807-2492. 609-807-2492. And I want to thank everybody that believed in me. Thank you. Thank you. I, I'm, I'm grateful for your belief in me because it fueled a belief in me. And so I'm here to let you know. I got tons of dreams. And right now, I'm trying to make sure that, that I'm aligned on where my dream is going to take me. I'm, I'm, but, but I'm ready, y'all. This show, every Monday night from 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock, I'm, I'm declaring a change. I know I'm going to start getting phone calls. I'm going to get emails from people who say, Troy, thank you for that word. Why? Because I decided to take that step. I decided that I'm going to take that step and I'm going to start that business. I decided to take that step. I'm going to go to that audition. I decided to take that step. I'm going to record that song. I decided to take that step. I'm telling you right now. And when you believe in yourself, 
others will start believing in you more. I'm telling you. And whatever you need, there's resources out there. There are. There are resources. So, again, follow us. Uh, again, my website. Listen, you y'all know I take pictures. Uh, uh, follow me on Instagram at pickbydesign. My website, picturesbydesign.smugmug.com. Picturesbydesign.smugmug.com. And I'm telling you right now, there is so much. Follow us. Uh, Facebook, Troy Alexander. Uh, and I'm telling you, yes, sir. Yes, sir, we're good. Uh, oh, we got a phone call. <laughs> so we got a phone call calling him. I'm telling you. Yeah. Deacon Troy, I enjoy one thing on your show a lot. You said tonight, it's not over yet. I'm 89 years old, wow. and I enjoy it. And I, I still believe that there is something I can do. Hallelujah. I thank God for you. I thank God for you. I enjoyed the show tonight. Oh, uh, thank God for you. Thank you, Missionary, Missionary Br Brown from um, from Prince Amboise. Thank you, Missionary Brown, so much. We love you. We appreciate you. Thank you so yes, much. Yes, yes, yes. Because I think I'm not 89 years old. Wow. I think it's over. But you said something tonight that let me know it's not over yet. It's not Hallelujah. over. No, she 89. It's not over, Missionary Brown. It's not over. Yes. Yeah. No, no. Thank you so much. I love you. I so appreciate you so much. Yes, Lord. All right, now. Love you now. Listen, y'all. That, that was Brother Brown. And listen, 89 years old, calling in, talking about it's not over. I'm telling you, this show is about believing and letting everybody know it is not, it's not about age. It's about what you want and what you are declaring and what you're going to get. I'm telling you right now. We're going to get some stuff. But you got to go get it. Don't, don't, don't sit home. Don't, I'm talking about, it, it's not going to fall out the sky. I got to go to wherever it is I'm looking for to receive it. I'm telling you, you got to walk through the door. You got to go make the phone call. Send the email. I'm telling you right now. There is power. Power in believing that there is more. Because when you know what? When you know there's more, whoo, it, it's, it brings about an excitement, about expectation. That's what knowing more does. It I, listen, I'm, I know there's some more stuff that I got to go get. It's coming my way. It's coming. And I'm excited. Might not see it all, but I know it's coming. I know something greater is coming in my life, in your life. I know it is. I know it is. I'm telling you, and when you get it, call this show back. <laughs> Woo! When you get it, uh, send us an email. Let us know that, that you know what, Troy, I heard what you said, and, I, and, and, and it, it changed something in my mind. It changed something in my thoughts, and, and, and now I'm in a better place. That's what I'm talking about. So I'm telling you right now, it's, 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 it's there. Do the work. Do the work. I just felt, felt led to say this. Yes, I went to college. I'm, I'm grateful, honored. Got my first master's in 1993 from Rutgers, social work. Got my second master's degree 10 years later. My goodness. Well, no, I'm sorry. Well, yeah, 94 rather. Then got my second master's 10 years later in public administration. I'm telling you right now, whoever will look back and say, wow, now, he has a bachelor's. Two masters. Listen, all I'm telling you is the blessings. But it's about a determination and saying to yourself, I want more. And I want to give another shout out to uh, Missionary Brown, to, uh, to uh, Mother Brown, because she was an encouragement to me growing up uh, in my church. And, and she would always give me an encouraging word and say, you know, Troy, you are inspiring. You are the young people. You are, you are an example. You are, that was an encouragement to me, even back then. So I thank, Michelle, I thank Mother Brown for, for, for pouring into my life. And I so appreciate her. I'm telling you right now, no matter what's going on, there's more. There is more for your life. There is more in your destiny. There's more with your purpose, with your name on it. And I'm telling you right now, I need you to hold on. Don't you let go. Don't you give up on, on don't give up on yourself.
But also, don't give up that on that one that, that's, that's in your space. Because I done seen things turn around. I done seen things turn around. I know people who, who were at the lowest of a low place. And guess what? I was one of them. Because I didn't have a belief. I didn't have a dream. I didn't have confidence. I didn't have. All I had was fear. All I had was fear. But, but, but I can turn it around now and, 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 and say, you know what? I, I used to have that, but I don't have it no more. That's why on the, on the last show, I sang the song. Didn't have no, I was a little nervous, but wasn't afraid. Nervousness is okay, but fear will hold you back. Don't let fear hold you back. Don't let it stop you from what's on the other side of that door. Do not allow it to be so. I'm telling you right now. So I'm grateful uh, for all of again for all of your support, all of you to watch us week to week. Thank you, thank you. I, 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 you know, you don't, don't, and I said it before. Do, do not get caught up in how many likes on your picture, or likes on your post, or likes. Because I'm telling you right now, it just might be the one person that changes everything around in your life. There was a story about a young girl. She was at a pool, and, 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 and her mother made these little pins that, that had these little uh, designs on it. And if you remember, I think it was the, 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 the Crocs, but, but it's the shoes that have the open uh, holes on top of it, like a, you know, and, and, and so the young lady put the, 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 the different things that the mother would design into the holes. And she's walking around the pool. Now, again, this is something that the mother just made up, right? So, so, so one man says, uh, um, uh, those are nice. Those are beautiful. Th those are really, that's different. And they say, well, and, and the girl said, oh, well, well, my mommy made these designs and put them on top of the holes so it gives them a new look. Unbeknownst to the young lady, um, the man she was talking to at the pool happened to be the man who was the owner of the Crocs company that made the shoe. So all I'm saying to you is, you don't never know. And, and I'm telling you, overnight, that mother, that family became like, <laughs> like instant millionaires. Because the owner said, I want those in my shoes. So all I'm saying to you is, Whatever it is you love to do, keep on doing it. Whatever you are expecting to be, keep on working at it. Because you never know who is in the room. You don't know who's watching this show. You don't know. Listen, I don't know. Oprah could be watching this show. T.D. Jakes could be watching this show. Uh, Tyler Perry could be watching this show. Uh, 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 Bill Gates could be watching this show. Channel Newt, you don't know who's watching this show. But I believe that whatever door is destined for my life is already open. It's just waiting for, for me to go through it. And the same for you. Jamie Roberts, thank you so much. Appreciate you watching. I'm telling you right now. So next Monday night, meet us right back here, 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time on Hamilton Radio. Inspiration with Troy Alexander. Dream, take that step and do what? Walk with purpose into your destiny. Have a great night, and I'll see you next Monday, 8 o'clock, right here on Hamilton Radio. Troy Alexander, Inspiration with Hamilton Radio.